once again you are welcome to your program pathfinder as i always say your worst days are over things can only get better this is the best time to be alive today i have with me on the program a special man when i say a special man i mean a man by hard work and god's favor he came out of those struggles doing very well. He's no one else but Dr. Alphonsus Epoerike. You're welcome, Doctor. Okay, um, first of all, uh, I must tell that uh, this is a great moment. Thank you so much thank you, sir. for this wonderful program. And then, uh, thank you also for the opportunity. Well, uh, my name you've had, um, I wish to let you know that uh, I started from a humble beginning, you know, I mean, silver and gold wasn't of our treasure, you know, but somehow through good mentorship, you know, and then a bearing, you know, I happened to face some obstacles growing up, and then uh, those obstacles are what kept me, or uh, what pushed me to where I am today. I, I, what kind of a doctor are you? I mean, is it medical doctor or just academic doctor or what do you Yeah, I'm doctor? a researcher, uh, neuroendocrinologist. Okay, so what does it mean, sir? Uh, it means uh, somebody who looks at uh, cases, uh, sicknesses that concerns a neuroendocrine okay. system and the nervous system. Yes. He is into neuro in the cream, whatever, <laughs> let me not bite my tongue. I know he's a neuroscientist and um, he has done a lot into in, in this area and um, he has a lot of information to tell us so that we could learn more about neuroscience. So can you tell us more about neuroscience? And things? Oh yes, well neuroscience is a subject uh, that treats or teaches about the brain and what the brain gives. Okay. Uh, tells you uh, the sicknesses and pathologies of the brain okay. and then also tells you how uh, the inf uh, how some things influences the brain that uh, influences your character or your behavior yeah that's a, a neuroscience and then uh, uh, we say is the last frontier mm. of knowledge you know and then in neuroscience, uh, there's a branch called neuroendocrinology. Okay. And then in neuroendocrinology, you have about three branches. Uh, you know, the bench, you know, which is called basic neuroendocrinology. And then you have the behavior, you know, and then you have the clinical neuroendocrinology. So uh, I happen to, you know, uh, have a combined this thing, uh, discipline in behavior and clinical. Okay. So, uh, Cause of doing this, uh, you know, I happen to uh, come across uh, 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 blessings of, of discovering another subject out of that called new, and I mean neuro script metry. Okay. Uh, neuro script metry tells about uh, the brain creativity, how you can you know create something out of nothing. Okay. Uh, in the past, the argument is that uh, creativity is a preserved thing for some certain privileged few. Mm -hmm. But now we say it's not true. Okay. And then there's also an argument that you cannot teach somebody how to invent. Mm -hmm. That inventors come up with idea, okay. which is true. Okay. Yeah, but then uh, with this course, you can teach somebody how to invent things. Okay. And we have a graded time of any person, if you attend the course, you know, even a class, you start inventing things. And then in uh, neuroendocrinology, neuroscrimetry, uh, there's a timed period by which you ought to invent things, which is too close to your hand, mm. I mean to your finger. Mm. And that's about three minutes, okay. within three minutes. It's like uh, in the Bible when Jesus told them that within three days it's going to be you know, rise up, yes, mm -hmm. or build the temple. Okay. So uh, this course is just a God-given uh, program, you know, that teaches people how to invent. 
Okay. Regardless of your educational background, you know, it teaches wow. you how to be better. Yeah. Wow. So you have courses, you know, which we run now, you know, um, in all the continents. Wow. You know, we run the courses all the continents, you know, and then uh, you have in Nigeria and uh, in Lagos, Imo State, uh, Abuja, okay. and then you have people, you know, going through the course you know, okay. in other places. And then this course you can also do from certificate to doctoral program. Wow. Yes. Okay. Tell if someone going to it, what is the qualification and all that? Well, okay. Let's talk about qualification. Qualification uh, is almost zero. You know, depends depends on where you want to in, engage okay. in the course. If you're coming in with uh, without any educational background, there's a place for you. Okay. You start from where we call the workshop certificate course. Oh. So you start from there. Anyway, every person starts from workshop certificate course. But those with degrees, you know, they have uh, 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 a phase that they now jump into because they have some uh, element of, uh, you know, articulations okay. you know, so but those without any kind of education they can do this course. Okay. I, I, I went through your profile and I saw that you is it an award or something induction into something something as an inventor can you tell us more about it <laughs> <laughs> oh yes uh, well you know uh, let me say it this way if a woman that cooks good food doesn't test it, how can she tell that her food is good? good? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, I teach people neurospermetry. I, I didn't put this thing uh, before. Neurospermetry has a, another name. Okay. A street name called invention technology. Okay. You know, that's to teach people how to create things. Because I teach people how to create things. If I don't create things, then how can I teach people? Go, you know, so yeah. now, you know, because of that, you know, I've created a lot of things from, uh, uh, from uh, uh, medicine to devices, medical or health devices okay. uh, or therapy, and then uh, created uh, uh, some gadgets, okay. you know, for facilitation of brain, you know, how to, wow. and then wow. uh, created some cosmetics. Wow. You know, uh, created some uh, agricultural something called land plate, wow. which you can use, you know, to plant something anywhere, regardless, even in a cemented place. Wow. You can use a land plate to do it, wow. you know, and then uh, you can also uh, uh, use uh, uh, another project that I have for solar. Okay. I mean, that gives light, but it's not solar, it's called fluorocell. Wow. Yeah, you know, it's cleaner than solar, mm. you know. Uh, so, I mean, a lot. I have about 36. Wow. On my district, yeah. Wow. So, but the one you saw was uh, maybe the one for, uh, we did for Magellan sickness, which is a little bit controversial okay. sickness here. So, we tackled it, and people were getting known. You know what causes the sickness, and you know, so we we worked on it. Mm -hmm. We we'll had a breakthrough. In it. Yeah. Wow! My viewers, what a wonderful time! Do you want to go into invention? This is the time for you. Don't tell me your background. You're not educated or whatever. Even if you're educated or not, you have the opportunity to get into invention technology. In fact, I'm start, I've started thinking of what I will invent talking to this man. Maybe, I don't know what I will invent, but I started thinking of something. <laughs> he came from nothing and he became somebody today. If this man can do it, you too you can do it.